Hey everyone, and welcome to 3.50 a.m. Also known as 9.32 a.m. in the Pokemon world. And in Germany, 9.50. So I guess Johto is like in a small, isolated time zone. 22 minutes before Germany. But anyway, um, why am I playing this at 3.50 in the morning? Well, I took a nap until 1 after I got home from school. So shut up. Anyway. And off screen we caught a Hoppip, which Rom decided I should name Malice, which is all too appropriate because Hoppips are full of malice and jump bluffs are really annoying to deal with when they're properly trained and they have tons of annoying moves. Cough, I'm looking at you, Kit. Cough, I'm even saying cough in order to indicate that this is You know what, never mind. That joke aborted. Okay, so why do I have a hop up when it's not on camera? Well, off screen, I went and leveled all my guys to about 10 after selecting the people based on the comments who I would use. And basically, the only change was I replaced the Whooper with the Mareep. So, yeah. As I continue to gain more Pokemon, you may post comments requesting that I replace something with new acquisitions. With the exception that Larry and Owl Get cannot be removed from the party. So anyway, let's continue this way to get wherever I was going to before. Screw you. Ah! No. What? Uh, let's see if Metronome does anything funny. During my off-camera leveling time, I got it to use things like Horn Drill, Flamethrower... Yeah, take him down, Ivo! Yeah! Alright! Metronome is, like, the most fun move ever put into Pokemon. But I imagine in competitive battling it would be absolutely useless. Which is exactly why if I ever recreate this team in modern day <laughs> Pokemon O-Vision, then I will definitely use it. Well, hello, Marie. I mean, Hoppip. I mean, whatever. Thank you for simulating that I ran into you by running into me. <laughs> oh, man. That would have been cool. Ah. Alright, Hoppips can't actually do anything in the wild, because they come with Splash and Synthesis. Hoppip, use your Splash Attack! It doesn't do anything. I still think they should have made Splash Attack have like a one in a thousand chance of instantly winning you the game. Sorry, you just lost the game. Wait, why am I doing this normal speed? Hop-ups are not nearly epic enough. Oh yeah, they have tail whip too, okay. So, ah, uh, Mareep. Die, Mareep. Die in the most bizarre way possible. Oh wait, I'm using all my PP. Oh man. This video is not very exciting so far. What am I doing? Why can't Togepi ever escape from a battle? Why do I have it in the lead? Why are there so many questions? So anyway, last time we were about to fight these two clowns over here. And by clowns, I mean fishermen, because those are two th the same, very similar things. Whoa! You made me lose that fish! Whoa! Not that it was a good fish, because it's just like a Magikarp, or a Goldeen, or one of your crappy other fish that you can have. Failed! Metronome should not fail. Come on, do something awesome! Um, yeah, that works. That's not bad. I mean, I just took a fish out by an, making an egg slam into it. That's kind of interesting, I think. It really speaks to my artistic nature and political sensibilities. I think. Do something awesome! Ugh. That's like the least awesome thing you can do with Metronome. So, do, do I keep using this every turn? Is that how that works? No. I'll just charm this fish to death while I smother it in my eggy vines. What the crap am I doing? How? Well, it's better than Snorlax flying, which can happen too. So, 
Hey, it's the Mareep that we have now. Let's show it off by utterly obliterating weak, useless fish. Which is definitely a way to show off your power. Sploosh! Go away, Mom! I don't want to be called in this time zone. Oh, that's nice. I forgot your mother could do that. Waste all your money that you're never going to use anyway! Ah! The nerve of that woman! Anyway, polywags. Those are cool, right? Splash! Fishermen should not talk in water on a monopias. That's not how things should work. The grass is full of clingy things! Oh god. I wonder what Japan has done with that line. Ugh. Don't want to think about that. Okay! No bell sprout porn for you. Okay. What's this guy doing? How would you like to have this tasty, nutritious, illegal slowpoke tail? Um, Team Rocket, blast off again, will you? Okay. What's in this poker center? Most likely healing. That's what they do in poker centers, you know? Oh no, a battle fight. That badge, it's from Violet City. You beat Falker! Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna preserve our life preserver. I mean, what am I talking about? We're going to keep metronome for like emergency situations when only chance can pull us through, which probably won't happen that often. But okay, we're gonna keep it for whenever I feel like maybe doing something awesome and maybe not doing anything awesome. Let's level up this crappy spider so he doesn't suck so bad. Okay, what are we doing today? Union Cave. Wow, it's a cave that I will unite with in the sense that I don't even know why this is called Union Cave. Oh no! A creepy old man, probably. It's always creepy old men in these kinds of games. Oh, it's a hiker. So he's just a creepy bearded guy. Oh no! This is the worst matchup possible in the history of ever. Larry! Kill! Hooray for Larry! Okay. I put a potion in my pockets! I wonder if they ever, like, spill or leak. Wouldn't that be a concern of some kind? Why, look, it's a rock monster! But it's not a rock lobster. It's actually a rock. Perhaps we may catch it with some licking? I don't think licking a rock is the greatest nutritional idea you could pursue, Frank. But what am I to tell a ghost how to lick its rocks? Did I catch it? Yes, I did. So, female Geodude. Yep. Not a Geodude. It's... It's a Geodudette. Which barely fits. So yeah, that's like a minor tradition that I have. I always seem to get female geodudes and then name them that. Anyway, rock Pokemon, I'm too lazy to not destroy them with Larry's. How hilarious. Ah, 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 oh, oh, oh. Zubat Supersonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. Uh, wait, what? Fire Breather? What? What does Constrict do again? I don't remember. I guess it's just a crappy attack. I don't know. Anyway, um... So, yeah. This guy talking about Zubats confusing his Pokemon? I think he's like... He must be the only trainer to actually have the same complaint as every player in the universe. Friggin' bats everywhere. It's like an infestation, but completely natural, so I can't complain about it to the local newspapers very efficiently. I don't even know. We're not gonna catch Zubat. No, I'll get. You must get Owl. I mean, Zubat. I mean, whatever. Yay, X attacks. I never use those things. Or X defense, or X specials, or whatever. 
I never use that series of items. I find it to be useless because I do not use them. That was redundant. Okay. So. Sigh. Friggin' cave. This video is boring. It's all your fault, cave. Cave music's kinda creepy if you think about it. Oh my god, a battle! I guess we'll end the video on the summary of the cave. Wild Zubat appeared. This has been Shag. That was part five. Um, maybe I should do these when it's not three in the morning. Four in the morning. Five in the morning.